what it do y'all welcome back to my channel family today is a special video because i hit 10,000 subscribers yesterday yes 10,000 subscribers yesterday i'm so geeked up i was so happy so i'm like why not do this video and help someone else be able to get today 10,000 subscribers it may not be big to people that got 100,000 subscribers or 1 million subscribers, but to you, if you got 10,000 or 1,000, whatever your goal is or whatever your short-term goal is and you reach it, you're going to be excited. So you celebrate it. Don't let nobody talk down on that. Don't let nobody make you feel bad because you don't have 100,000 subscribers or 1 million subscribers. You reach your goal. It's big to you and it's big period to YouTube to reach 10,000 subscribers. Yes. So yesterday I did a video on like on how I celebrated reaching 10,000 subscribers. So today I did like a photo shoot and stuff. That's why I have on my yellow. So my theme colors for my banner up at the top of my YouTube channel are pink and yellow. So it's like a pink lemonade thing. So I got on all yellow today and like some gold sequin shoes because my banner have like gold in it. So I kind of like want to match the theme of my of my YouTube thing. And also to do pictures, I had got some prompts. I got this um little prompt that say Hollywood and scene director and take one I thought this would have been so cute for pictures and stuff so yeah those are the things that I wanted to do to celebrate my channel for reaching 10,000 subscribers also my man had bought me some of these masks they have like my um my banner this is what's on the top of my banner like oh my god now I got my own mask like I was not into wearing the mask but now I'm gonna wear this like every day everywhere so those are some of the things that i did to like celebrate it was a celebration yesterday and it's a celebration today too because i'm actually doing a photo shoot so i got like tons and tons of pink and yellow balloons i did photo shoots so if you want to see those pictures make sure you follow my instagram at ida elizabeth with two h's or you can follow me at natural ida also i post there also but let's get to the topic at hand about how to reach 10,000 subscribers I'm gonna say first thing first, you have to be consistent. Like consistency brings out good no matter what, no matter how many times you do it wrong. If you keep doing it, it'll come out right and it'll work out for the best for you because it did for me. Like don't give up, keep going. Like don't post a video once every month or don't post a video every once every six months and don't get discouraged because you have like low number and views and stuff like that. So don't get discouraged, stay consistent. That's what consistent mean. Like if you wanna say, I wanna do videos once a week or once every two weeks, however many times you want to do videos, stay consistent with that because consistency makes people believe that you have drive so consistency make people believe in you and if you stay consistent that'll make you want to do it more because you will start seeing better results so the better results you get the more it'll make you want to do it I'm just telling you what I did and how I got to 10,000 and I got to 10,000 so you must take this advice on being consistent and believing in yourself first of all you got to believe in yourself to even start and I say also like if you start getting discouraged to where you like, oh, I don't feel like doing it or I really don't want to do it today. I'll do it tomorrow. Never procrastinate. Do today what you could do tomorrow because why procrastinate? Like this is what you want to do. You're not going to see good results if you just keep saying I'm going to do it tomorrow or I'm going to do it next week. I'm going to do it on the weekend. No, do that first. Like make this your priority over anything. Like you have to make YouTube your priority if you want to get 10,000 subscribers or if you want to just make it big, period. You have to make YouTube your priority. Also, don't have people around you that discourage you or that don't believe in you. Have people that believe in you, that want to help you, that help you with video ideas and stuff. Don't let nobody around you that don't want to be in front of the camera, that say like, why are you doing that? They want to keep trying to understand because that discourage you if you keep on trying to like explain to somebody what you're trying to do because it sounds like they like belittling you. So don't let those people and those company like around you like keep nothing but positivity keep like-minded people even if you can find somebody else that do youtube or that like doing videos or even social media period mm -hmm. be around them people and be encouraged by those people even if you have to find somebody on youtube or social media that will like encourage you to want to be better do that also not saying be like somebody else be yourself but find people that like will encourage you to make you want to be better and do more 
So every time you post, just, just watch your videos, realize things that you can get better at, get better at editing, get into YouTube groups if you can, people that'll help you like share their videos, share yours, watch yours. You wanna be encouraged like with people that's like-minded. Like I said, get into like YouTube groups and stuff and cause them are like-minded people. And YouTube groups is on social media. I think all social media platforms right about now. So even if you find your niche, if you can do something every day, if you feel like, you know what, I'm gonna post a video every day, but don't just post random stuff that kind of like don't make sense. Post stuff that makes sense and that'll make people want to watch and make people want to hit that subscribe. That's the whole thing. Like subscribers is not promised. You have to make people want to hit that subscribe. And you also have to tell people to subscribe because sometimes people will just watch your channel and if you didn't mention to subscribe, you might make them forget also. So never forget to say, hit that subscribe button. Please hit that subscribe button and tell them to smash the like button and comment down below. You want engagements and stuff. That's how you get to 10,000 subscribers or 1,000 or whatever your goal that you're trying to get to. You need engagement on your channel. You need people to smash the like button. You need people to comment down below. You need them to hit that subscribe button most importantly. And also you don't want people just subscribing and not watching because that kind of like defeats the purpose too because you're not seeing engagement. So yeah, you want people to engage. So encourage them to comment down below. Be friendly let them know you will talk to them bring good energy to your channel always bring good energy never be in front of your camera in a bad mood in a down mood because you make people in a bad mood in a down mood if you are like energy transfer so always be happy never turn on that camera if you sad unless i guess you're doing like a sad video or something sad happened and you're trying to tell your subscribers what happened i guess but never just be on there because you know what people can read through video how you feel i know i can i can read if you really want to be in front of that camera or not or if you're being fake so just be real, be yourself, and bring good energy to your subscribers and to your viewers also. You may have some downtime. You may feel like you don't want to do it sometime, but just always remember what your goal is. Always remember why you started. That will make you want to keep going if you just remember the goal. Always remember the end goal. Write it down in the book, your end goal, and keep getting closer and closer to it. Every time you get closer to it, trust me, it'll make you want to do it. It will not discourage you if you're getting closer to your goal. But to do that, you need to be consistent. And if you don't have a niche, that's kind of like, okay, sometimes you can be all over the place until you find your niche, but don't not start because you think you don't have a niche. Do you like be yourself, make videos around you, create around you. That's, that's what makes it real. But when you do find your niche, it'll be all gravy. And niche meaning like if I wanted to do cooking videos, I'll do cooking videos. If I wanted to do vlogs, I'll just do vlogs. Or if I wanted to do fashion, you know, like that's what niche is. Like finding your niche of which videos that you want to do and create for your subscribers. And also don't forget when you get to that goal, be happy, be excited and celebrate. Don't look at it as small. Remember it's big, celebrate it. Never forget your goal, your short term goal is big also. Don't care about what people think. It might be people in your comments saying bad stuff. Do not worry about what they saying. Just look at the good people, at the good feedback, the positive feedback. Just remember that. Just ignore all the bad comments and the bad feedback. We're not focused on them. Only focus on the positive people. Share on your social medias. If you have like Facebook, Instagram and stuff like that, share with your people. If your followers don't know what you're doing, they don't know what's going on. So share what you're doing on your Instagrams and Facebook. That also helps. You want as much as like feed to your YouTube channel as possible, like from any and everywhere. Even if you out and about, you could tell people to subscribe to your channel that you may run across or start talking to. Tell them to subscribe too. Tell family members to subscribe. Tell friends to subscribe, but don't, don't pest them, but tell them to subscribe. Me, myself, I did it all on my own as far as not collabing yet. I have not did no collaboration yet. So if you can collab, if you know somebody that do YouTube, collabing will be awesome. That probably will get you to your 10,000 subscribers faster. I don't know, but I did it all on my own with no other YouTube, with no collaboration. I'm looking forward to do collaboration in the future or in the near future, but so far I haven't did no collaborations and I reached my 10,000 subscribers. So it can be done, like I say, if you be encouraged and be consistent and know that this is what you want to do and make this your priority oh y'all and it's something else that i wanted to do like seriously all these balloons is like so cute and pretty and stuff but it's a celebration you know oh my goodness i did not know it was gonna be that loud oh 
I just wanted to do that. So make sure you smash the like button for this video and comment down below any questions you may have for me that I didn't answer or that I didn't speak on in this video because I do talk back. And don't forget to subscribe. Make sure you subscribe and click the notification bell that pop up right next to it so you won't miss no videos that I drop. But for now, your girl is out. Peace.